Well, hello friends, good day, and welcome back to Stardew Valley Modded. Super fun, I do believe today is the uh, festival day. And it's also a somewhat annoyed spirit day, and the weather for tomorrow is beautiful and sunny. Hey, so I was looking around and poking around and checking out some things. Did you know that strawberries cost 100 each? And a base strawberry only gives you 120? That's a profit of 20 on average. I mean, you know, if you're looking at just the, like the lowest tier, because we don't really have the ability to slap down a lot of fertilizers and all that kind of good stuff uh, in terms of uh, that. And, and, and also we're only getting two harvests. So it's like, okay, well you plant it once you get two harvests. So you're making 40. Okay, let's just say. Compared to uh, cauliflower, which, you know, at Joja costs you like 70, right? Uh, but you're making 175 m minimum. So you're making about 100. And if you get a silver one, according to the wiki here that I'm looking at currently, you end up with over 200. So 70 to 200, that's like a three times increase. And that doesn't happen with strawberries. So I've really been thinking about the strawberry thing. And so I did a little research on it, as uh, obviously you probably have noticed by now. <laughs> And I think we're going to skip the strawberries, and we're just going to go straight for cauliflowers. Uh, we have enough time to do, like, one more, at least one more big group of cauliflowers. So I think we'll do that. We won't do it this coming up day, because this is the festival day. Um, so we're going to have to do that the next day, I guess. I, anyway, I think that's right. So to go back to what I was saying in the, the, like the previous episode, it's not that you can't make money on strawberries. It's just that I feel like it's more profitable to make money on strawberries by making them into, I don't know, uh, wine or something, uh, which we can't do yet. So here we are. We are going to buy a, a large quantity of cauliflower. Uh, tomorrow, Sunday. And we're going to go to the egg festival in just a minute. We're going to water our plants here. And then after the festival, I think what we'll do, we'll probably just go fishing for a little bit. I think the egg festival will take a bit of time in the recording. There's a lot of people to talk to. And, of course, the egg hunt to do. Uh, which I might not succeed at. Um, I'm thinking, too, as much as I really want to upgrade my axe... It might be more beneficial in terms of energy conservation at the moment uh, to upgrade the watering can next. So I'm going to ponder that because our pickaxe is not done yet. <laughs> Clint is still very dedicatedly working on it. I am sure he's working very hard to get that done. By which I mean he's not doing anything because it's a festival day. Okay. I hope you all detected the sarcasm. All right. We're going to sell all those. Uh, we do need to save one for the summer luau, I suppose. That is something that needs to happen. Oh, look at that forage. Well, hello there. Saturday's a great day to find forage around. Just saying. We are going to get over there, never fear. We're just going to swing down by the... Here we go. By the the giant grandpa shed here. Because I know very well that there are a lot of bushes here. I doubt the game will be so kind to us as to give me the bush hat. But if you don't look, then you don't find. So we're looking. And we're not finding. But we got some fiber. I mean, that's good, right? I like fiber. Do you guys like fiber? Fiber is good. It's important in your diet. You should all have fiber in your diet. Uh, it helps you out. Yep. Okay. Well, I think that's most of the bushes. There is an artifact spot. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. I have such a hard time finding that. Oh, that's awesome. We got it. We got the chip. Oh, look at all the people, everybody. Look at this. Look at how many people there are. It's ridiculous. 
Holy cow! Good gracious! There are so many people! So many people! Oh my gosh! Wow. Okay. Alright. We gotta calm that voice down. We gotta just... Just... Breathe. Ah, breathe. Can we say hi to Woofers? Nope, you cannot say hi to Woofers. There's Harvey. Hey, Harvey, what's up, buddy? Eggs definitely have a place in the well-balanced diet. I do like eggs, especially with corned beef hash. I'm just saying. Can you not bother me? Oh, okay. I have to study for my trials. Oh, whoa. Um, wh I... Why did you come to the festival then? I don't... Okay. Have a good day, I guess. I keep warning Lenny and Lewis, but they never listen. What, what do you warn them about? Exactly. Is it like sort of a vague warning? I mean, I'm just curious. Does your character ever blink in this? Oh, yeah, there we go. I'm like, do we ever blink? No, we do. Okay. They're sweet. They showed up at our house bright and early to get ready for the festival. It was a lot of fun. Oh, well, that's fun. What do you think of my dress? Uh... Isabel, um, I'm not sure. It looks chic, doesn't it? I mean, I guess? Yeah, sure, you're rocking it. I like it. Uh, what do you like? Do you like my Joja shirt? I'm a big fan. Ugh, I should be at the research facility working on something more useful than this. Is that a dateable redhead? I'm just saying. Are you going to participate in the egg hunt? Uh, I'm going to lose the egg hunt, so I guess that's a yes. I love the versatility of eggs. I do keep in mind to avoid the yolk, though. Gotta watch your cholesterol when you get to be my age. <laughs> all right, cool. This festival's all right, but I'm really looking forward to the flower dance. I try to eat at least three eggs every day. I gotta bulk up. Let's get that protein. All right. Hello, Carmen. How are you? Uh, you think I might be more excited for the spread than the contest? I mean, I like food too. It's a nice break from the usual fishing I have to do. Carmen seems nice. Sometimes I hide an egg too well and no one finds it. Well, until summer rolls around and the hot air starts to bring out the smell. Oh. Oh my. <laughs> Someone's gonna miss an egg and then it's gonna stink up the whole melon farming village valley. Well, you're... I mean, Willie just talked about that, too, so I think you guys are on the same page. Have you met? You could be friends. The festival's been a tradition as long as I can remember. Connects us with both the past and the future and is comforting. Okay. So everybody's so happy about <laughs> Eggs. Why eggs? Because they're tasty, George. The food at these festivals ain't so bad. Uh, it tastes even better if Pierre and Lewis use my crops, though. I love your hat. Can I get can I get Andy's hat as my own hat? I want a Jojo hat. Mm, devil's age get better every year. I do like deviled eggs. Uh when they're not in my mouth. Meaning I don't like them at all. Happy egg fest! Hello, Lola. Are you joining the hunt this year? I mean, I think that's the plan. Sure, yeah. Did we talk to everybody here? Did I talk to you? Okay. He's he's super fast, is he? Oh. Has to be to get away with his pranks. Are you trying to say that you catch him a lot? Is that... Searching for eggs is like going on a treasure hunt? I mean, I guess. There's there's golden treasure inside of them. We used to do a rotten egg toss. Mayor Lewis put an end to that. Oh my. <laughs> I can see why. I'm wearing my best slacks and dress shirt today. I mean, I appreciate that, but... I don't understand it. As someone who hates to dress up, um, it's, it's, I don't, I don't get that. I saw a couple eggs already, but I don't really want to join. Well, why not? You should come and, like, totally win. It's great to see the kids having so much fun with the egg hunt. Sometimes I wish I could join them, but that'd be weird, right? I mean, I feel that way. Why am I, as an adult, doing it? I don't understand it. I've never understood it, but here we are. He grumbles, but I think George enjoys himself deep down. You might, you might be right. Oh my gosh, there's more people over here! Set up some fake egg stink bombs where I know Abigail likes to search. <laughs> it's amazing! <laughs> what a line of dialogue! Not my fault, Louie happened to find one first! 
Oh, man. It's not cheating to ask people to let you win, is it? I don't, I mean, you can ask. That No one's going to listen, but you can ask. I don't know how, but uh, he's going to cheat. I know he is. Oh, Trini, come on now. You'd be nice to the young man whose name I don't know how to pronounce. Oh, she, what? He's mean? Sean's mean? Why is Sean mean? What? He's acting tough, but man, he's a child of throw. I hear some people in the city use applesauce as an egg substitute. Guess it's harder to get fresh eggs there. I mean, maybe? They're making fun of me. Do they really think they'll hurt my feelings that way? I got more friends at home. Mm hmm. Or do you? Hello. Well, hello, Jacob. All right. Loves birds. Never been particularly interested in the egg hunt. Probably because Abigail always wins. <laughs> Did you know a hen lays around 530 eggs in her lifetime? I'm pretty sure we can beat that in Stardew Valley, kid. Okay, listen. They just lay eggs until you stop playing. <laughs> it's amazing. Remember when Anton and I were younger? Well, hello, Paula. We always ran for the eggs. It ended up being more of a race than a scavenger hunt. We were just reminiscing about our childhood. Man, are we both competitive. Are, are you guys together, or...? I mean, I don't know who's with who. I and mean, this is modded world that we're in. No one really talks to me. I just come here for the deviled eggs. Linus, you can have all of my deviled eggs, okay? It's fine. I don't particularly need them, because, as I said, I don't like them. <laughs> We've been blessed with good weather. That is true. Eggs are of good quality this year. Uh, at least one thing in this festival is right. Wow, someone's a little hoity-toity there. A little toity-hoity. You know, I get what Lewis said about acting my age, but I could still win the egg hunt if I wanted to. <laughs> Taking breaks and work and making more productive. I feel the same way in real life. Sometimes the temptation is to take too many breaks. You gotta watch out for that. No, the fruit punch is unusually good. It's the secret ingredient. Bacardi. That's right. I always look forward to these gatherings. I feel like a community. I feel overcrowded. That's how I feel. I can't even talk to Gus. The children have been looking forward to this for weeks. Have they? When does the egg hunt start? I'm excited. Hope I can find some eggs before Vincent takes them all. Oh, man. Wish we had some coffee. We could find eggs even faster. Our hands have been working overtime to prepare for this festival. They deserve the best. Lots of sweet yellow corn. Oh, delicious. Can I have some sweet yellow corn? That sounds great. I love corn. Have you noticed how they don't seem to put an age limit on the egg hunt? I have noticed that. It's most appealing for the children, but no one has an issue with young adults like Abigail joining. I'm glad that someone finally said it, even if it is from a mod. <laughs> it needed to be said. Miss Evelyn's deviled eggs are really good. She told me she puts chili powder on top instead of paprika. That's a secret from Gus, though. Hmm. All right, what you got? I mean, yeah, we could buy some strawberry seeds. Uh, and I think I will buy some just to have some for, like, year two, but... A decorative pitchfork? Oh, man. All right, we are going to buy some seeds just to have them on hand. Eggs make Bert gassy. Ooh, that's unfortunate. If it doesn't slow down, he's sleeping on the couch. You're banished. Okay, you're banished to the couch. It doesn't get much better than this. Bright sun, cool breeze, good deviled eggs, and apparently intestinal fortitude problems. I feel you. Eggs don't always agree with me either. I feel giddy inside. Okay. I'm excited for the main event later on. Oh, I already spotted some eggs while we're waiting. Uh, could you, like, point them out to me? Because I could use any and all help. Thank you. Have you tried... The what? The... I don't know the second. Loco something. It's a customary dish. A white rice smothered in hamburger meat, fried egg, and homemade gravy. I mean, I'd eat it. Favorite way to eat is morning eggs. Oh, interesting. Is that, like, a hint? Can I learn how to make that? And then... That's how we be friends? Hmm? 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 I'm asking. No? Okay. Is there any more food? I don't think there is. Can I talk to Gus? 
I hope everyone's enjoying the food. I've been cooking for days. Fried eggs, boiled eggs, poached eggs, deviled eggs, scrambled eggs, chocolate eggs, you name it. Excuse me, Clint. <laughs> Poor Clint. Just get run over every time. I don't know how to spread, Gus. And what's that? How do you say that? Pika? Pika? I don't know. I hate new names. I have to learn how to say everything. <laughs> scrumptious is a great word, though. That That is not used enough in life. Scrumptious. Ah, what a good word. Hope I can join them next year. Be a great honor. I do not. Cooking is not for me. How? Oh, there's Sophia. I get nervous around large crowds of people. Ooh. You're probably having a moment then. Yeah, I get it. Vincent loves the festival. It's a joy to see him so happy. I've been up since dawn coloring eggs. Always my favorite part of the season. Well, let's go. Oh, Demetrius. Egg, what a strange thing to eat. My, my, what a beautiful day for a festival. Are you participating in the egg hunt? I, I don't think I have a choice. I think I kind of, like, it's part of the thing. Hey, I put some... Something nice into the punch. It was Bacardi. <laughs> it's just between you and me. Ha <laughs> ha! You fill your plate with ham, eggs, greens, and rolls. You eat it in one sitting and wash it down with orange juice. It was delicious. I didn't know you could talk to the table. Is that new? I don't think I ever tried before. Oh my gosh. Have we always been able to do that? Uh, okay. Lorenzo says, what is that? Is that, I don't know. We're not even gonna try, you guys. Lorenzo has a crush on someone. Sorry, I can't help myself. Festival's in no way sweet, but I can't help but appreciate my wife. Oh, well that's so nice. What has my husband been telling you? Hope they're good things about me. I mean, I think he's got the hots for you. I don't know if you've noticed through the years of being married. Spring's a busy time of year. It's nice to have a day off. Is it, though? Is it, Robin? There's so much to do, Robin. All the time. Abby's always loved the egg hunt ever since she was a tiny girl. Oh, well. It, it's good to love things. Hello, Marlin. Even with my bad leg, I never miss a town festival. Are you sure? Oh, well, there's a basket there. Let's see. Do we miss anyone? Is anyone hiding out in the fields? Just like... Way out in the middle of Nowheresville, just having a moment by themselves. That is a flower. Not an egg. Thought it was an egg. Well, hello. I love how Emily's done with the painted egg. She has a nice eye for color. Welcome to the Egg Festival. Compliments of my wonderful brood of hens. I was that compliment was spelled with an I. Is that wrong? <laughs> Everyone's ready? Yeah. And we're ready to lose the egg hunt, Lewis. That's what... Oh, gosh. Uh, uh-huh. Time for the highlight of the festivities, the uh, spring egg hunt. Calm down now, you're gonna need all your energy if you hope to find the most eggs and take home the prize. Okay. Now is everyone ready? I mean, I guess. Let it begin. I don't... I don't even see... There's one. I see another one up there. I don't know what a good root is anymore. You know? I feel like there's more over here. Right, that's five? That's not bad. There's six on the left. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Here's ten. I got ten. That's not bad. I feel like there should have been one more somewhere. I feel like I missed something. <laughs> Ten's not bad. I feel proud of myself. I'm, I don't think it's enough to win. 
<laughs> Look at all the eggs. Now, if only I could get you to pick up litter. That's true. There is a lot around town right now. You're not wrong. And the winner is... Me! What? Ten was enough? <gasps> I, what an honor! I, it is an unexpected moment of joy! We got the hat! Yes! My favorite thing! <laughs> we were successful! Oh, man! I did not expect to get it. I didn't. We're gonna equip it right now. I'm gonna put that on. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's so good. Okay, now, the question is, if, if we plant these, we can get some strawberries out of it. But we'll have to water them. And, uh, I just don't want to use the energy for that, because we're not going to get much money from it. We're just going to literally save the seeds until the next year. That's what we're doing. Hopefully that doesn't annoy uh, too many of you uh, viewers. Um, just know that that choice is done very deliberately. We could, we could plant them. We could get two harvests out of it. Kind of make, you know, maybe we should. We'll get our money back, right? If we do that? Hang on. We would at least make our money back. And we would be left with bonus strawberries. So let's go down here, I guess, and we'll plant them. All right. One, two, three, four, five. S oh, there's, is there, is that a plant there? Are you a plant? I think so. Uh, we'll just real fast. There we are. There's all our strawberries. We'll just plant those up real fast. I guess we don't have time to go fishing, really. By the time we walk down there, you know, it's going to be all over. But it's, it's all ogre now. It's over now. We planted the seeds, even though initially I didn't think that I would. <laughs> it must have been a poor choice. Oh yeah, I remember what song that is now. It must have been love, but it's over now. It took me a minute. My brain knew the tune, but my head didn't supply all the lyrics uh, as quickly as normal. Got some seaweed. Mmm, delicious. And some algae. Lovely. That'll go great when we start building some fish ponds. Hello, kitty cat. Oh, you're cute. You know, I thought of a good name for the cat after we've named the cat. Do I know what that name was? It was Shelly. Shelly the cat would have been a great name. Did I think of that in time? No. Do I feel dumb about that and a little irritated? Maybe. Maybe I do. Uh, yeah, I probably, you know, in all honesty, I do. <laughs> just a, just a little bit. Is there a rename your cat mod? Is that? <laughs> Weather report? Oh, lots of pollen. Oh, man. Queen of sauce. Coming at you with some coleslaw. Oh, yeah. Uh, coleslaw can be a lot more. You gotta have uh, vinegar and mayonnaise and uh, you're, you're all set. We can make coleslaw. Fortune teller today is dispo. Oh, well, they are very unhappy. On the upside, our pickaxe is ready. The new rods I'm selling, the best that money can buy. Oh, well. Mm. Oh, must be iridium. I need more copper ore before we can upgrade our watering can. Good morning, Stormy. Listen, Stormy, I know that I said that I didn't like your name. I lied. A Stormy is a great name, but Shelly would have been maybe better. <laughs> Since we are on the surf and turf farm, the beach farm. Ah, uh, I wish I would have thought of that sooner. That would have been a great name. Stormy was inspired by somebody's comment. Something about a storm or storm clouds or something like that. And I don't remember the exact comment. I just remember thinking, oh yeah, Stormy. Stormy would be a great name. Uh, so that's where that that's where that came from. We have got to clean up the farm. We uh we have just got to. 
a chicken statue, otherwise known as $100. That's right. 100 more for you and for me in the bank. Very exciting. All right, we got to get over to Joja today and buy some cauliflower seeds. Oh, and all of our forage is done. Yes, very nice. Look at that. Excellent. Well, that will save a little bit on some initial watering, but we will have to water more. Oops, I missed. All right, so we're going to have time and energy to water all of this, run into town, grab cauliflower seeds, run back, plant cauliflower seeds, and then get to the mine, make enough copper <laughs> to upgrade our watering can or something. I don't... We got to we gotta be ready for the next time it rains so that we can get that taken care of. There goes at least half our energy. Oh, we've run out of water. I love the question mark. Like, I'm not sure, but I do believe we are out of water. It's a protocol droid. No, just don't, don't worry about it. Just ignore that. Okay, are there any... There's a pine tree. I was going to see, are there any pine cones down here? We are low on pine cones. We need more pine cones. Yes. Aha. There's another one. Good, good, good. I like it. Let's go drop off our forage. We'll be able to make some seeds out of that. Oh, it's a Sunday. That means we can give more gifts. Just grab one of those. <laughs> Chicken statue. Away with you. Uh, we do have some silver horseradish. Okay. Meow. And let's see what's laying around. Uh, look, it's another one. Ray. Oh, there's another one there too. Oh, there's some on the left. Well, there's stuff everywhere. Well, well, well. What do you know? Okay, let's go say hi to Clint. We'll swing by Joja on the way. We'll check the bulletin board and see if there's anything exciting there that we need to stop and, uh, you know, do. Nothing posted? Man. It's Haley's birthday. Well, welcome to Pierre's. Hey, hello. Hello. Aha, uh -huh. there you are. You're not good enough friends to enter their... No! Caroline! Caroline! Sweet Caroline. Wow, wow, wow. Could you please leave your bedroom? I was hoping that since Abigail opened the door, we could... <laughs> we could get in there, but... No. That's a shame. That's a real shame. I cry on the inside. Woohoo! Um, there we are. And I need some cauliflower seeds. Um, I'm thinking like 20? I don't know that I can water many more than that without like seriously impairing my ability to function in the rest of the day. So we're just going to go with 20. Okay. Okay. Now, I could plant those today. I don't have to. We have a little time, but... There's the pickaxe back. Thank you so much. Appreciate you very much, Clint. And I have, back at the house, I have three copper ore. Since we're already out... Oh, I don't have my sword. Never mind. I was just going to say, let's just go to the mine, but I don't have, my, I don't have a sword. Well, that put the brakes on that plan in a hurry, didn't it? Ah, oh, goodness. Is there any forage over here? Do we have any just like chilling in the back over this way? Oh, there's one. There's a fishing spot. Oh, it's so tempting. It is so tempting. Okay, so now we have almost 4,000 saved. Um... 
I think what I will attempt to do... Oh, you know, it's Sunday, isn't it? Sunday, Sunday. Oh, we could have gone to the museum and dropped off the artifact. Oh, well, we'll get, we'll get around to it. Oh, there's one cut. No, that's not. <laughs> do you? Oh, now that's... That is very tempting. Also a rare seed. Ooh. Hey, look, it's our good friend Sashimi, otherwise known as the Sandfish. Oh, 1,800, though, is kind of a lot, but... Like, you're saving eight squares of watering every day. Is that worth half my money? Or do we just... Do we just buy the rare seed? That'd be 2800 what we would have spent today if we buy both of these. That feels like a lot. Yep, we're going to do it. We're getting them both. Okay, there. Now we don't have to worry about rare seeds. Although I will say, maybe we just keep looking for them, and as long as we can afford it, we should buy one. Imagine if we're able to buy, like, one a week from now until the beginning of fall. We'd have what? Let's see, four, six, six, six gem berries? I mean, that, that is not a bad amount of money. Hmm. And that's assuming we only find one a week. Yes. Okay, well. That certainly was a change for the poorer, but um, I think it'll work out for us. Let's get down here. We got to figure out where we're going to put this for the most benefit here. Um, it's not going to help us much today, but I'm maybe there? That might be the best spot. There, we'll put it there. I mean, it will, it will help me, and that's all that matters, even if it's not on this particular day. That is still a large assistance. And I'm all for it. I am all for it. You know, we might need another Scarecrow soon. I was thinking about that the other day, too. You know, it's, it's probably about time. we got to be getting close. We have three left. Okay. One, two, uh, three. There we go. Now, the only thing that that really puts into jeopardy is having enough money to upgrade the watering can. I think we'll still be okay by the end of the season. Well, we might need to do a little more fishing, obviously. But, uh, you know, outside of that, I think we'll be all right. You know what? Let's put the tools over here. So we're going to the mines. Go into the mines and we're gonna find some copper right now. That's right. That's what we're up to. Let's move this over here. Let's move that over there. Uh, real fast also. Let's just make a couple more of those. Can I eat this mushroom too? Yeah. There we go. Eat the mushroom. Chomp. Very nice. And we want a couple of those. And we're going to chomp one right now. There we go. Oh, yeah. That is plenty of energy. Uh, it is a displeased spirits day. Let's try to remember that. We, we don't need to get down five floors, although it would be ideal. Um, I do. I just need copper. I mean, really, that's that's what we need. But I think ore spawns are lower on a low luck day, so that's a bit of a shame. It is. Oh, there's a leak, though. Hey, uh, good friend. Would you like this? That's a great gift. Thank you. You are welcome. It was even a gold star. I hope that you very much appreciate that gold star that I just gifted you with. Gold star! It's not quite the same as a world star, but hey, it's a thing. A signpost. 
<laughs> Look at all the things that are around. Oh. There are so many. Also, we gotta we gotta buy our Joja membership. Let's not forget that either. It's five thousand. Kind of a lot. Down to floor twenty we go. Alrighty. Alright. Oh good, 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 good. There's I see the ore already. Yes, excellent. Alright, well. Two is more than we had. Two is more than we had. Ooh, there's some... There's some... Cots there! Yeah, I think you need the scythe, don't you? For to find the... Uh, the bug... The bug hat. The bush hat. Yes, even more copper. It'll be great on top of that. Coal. <laughs> would love to find some coal or an ancient seed. Oh, an ancient seed would be so glorious. I would plant it right now. Yes, I would. I got stuck. I was looking at something else. Mostly it was that slime, but... A chewing stick. Have we already dropped that off? Yeah, we did. Okay. Yeah, we got a glow ring. Alright, well... Better than not having a glow ring. Have we dropped off an amethyst yet? Uh, looks like we did. Okay. We're on floor 23, not bad, not bad. Oh, here we go. Oh, look at this. That's what we're talking about. Ow, how dare you. Ow, we got slimed. We were gacked. You guys remember, you guys remember Gack from Nickelodeon? That might be before some of your time. With Mark, uh, Mark Somers, was it? Was that his name? I don't remember names. I'm bad with names. You might have noticed that just in this playthrough today. So we can go down there, but... Oh, we can go down there too. But over this way, there were a bunch of crates, and I would like to break them. Because you just never know what you might find in them. And we didn't get much. We did get some copper, though, which is good. We're up to 34 copper. And here's a floor that has an elevator. Get a little bit more mining experience while we're here. We'll just do a quick little, quick little loop here. See if there's any gemstones or anything. I don't see any. I don't care about that one stone there, honestly. All right. Back out we go. All right. Well, we made it down five more floors. That's good. Got a lot of bug meat to turn into bait, which is also good. We got some quartz, which we'll need for various uh, upgrades. Did we drop a quartz off? Yes, we did. Oh, hey, look at that. I did get some coal. Well, then. Well, well, well. Very exciting. All of that is very exciting. We go back over to the farm. We'll drop a bunch of stuff off. Do I change some of that bug meat into bait? Maybe I do. I think I still have like 40, though, on the fishing pole. And uh, maybe we wait till we're actually, you know, like lower. That might not be a bad idea either. I don't think we'll plant those rice seeds. I don't really believe I have a deep invested desire to do that. You know what? Let's let's just use some energy. We've got the uh, the pickaxe back. So since we're here and I was complaining about it, clear up some of this stuff on the farm. 
<laughs> Sounds good, right? Okay, so we <laughs> we need an iron pickaxe. Got it. I can never remember. Like, seriously, never. Okay. We're just gonna take care of all this while we're over here. I think that'll go well. Ah, what a good episode, everybody. I had a great time. Oh, the uh, the spring uh, egg hunt was good. We we won. I got my hat. So I feel like it's a real Stardew Valley playthrough now. I have my hat. Things are completed as far as that goes. It's very nice. There's so many things out here to... Just get rid of... Eat the carrot. Look how much... So many piles of stone still out here. It's crazy. All right, we got to put the slime away. How did I not have slime in there? What's hap no, What is going on with... The bug meat stays. Okay, but the slime... There we are. Uh, do we keep this as a gift? We are going to sell that. I'm going to sell this. Don't care about no, no rice. Okay. 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 Um. Yeah, we have another 50 bait in here. Good gracious. Let's grab all our tools out. Also that, so that I don't forget it in the next episode, which is a real danger. If we're honest with ourselves. Oh yeah, 83, that's... That's plenty. Time for sleeping then. Here we go. I think that sprinkler is going to be a big help personally. We made z almost zero monies <laughs> back, but that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Listen, we got a sprinkler. We got a rare seed. We got some sunflowers plant. Uh, sunflowers. Oh my gosh. Some strawberries planted. And uh, we found this amazing chipped pot thing so yeah i mean we'll call it a success okay okay cool hey everybody thanks for watching so much appreciate y'all we'll see you in the next episode have a great week and until then take care